From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good morning. I am your student meteorologist, Paul Michalajczyk, with this wonderful Friday morning edition of the Campus Weather Service forecast. You can see that the sun has finally risen. You can see that outline of the Appalachians finally starting to become visible. Clouds off in the distance. That snow is still on the ground because it is a very cold start to your morning today. Uh, temperatures right around three degrees to start your morning. It feels like minus nine uh, because we've got that wind coming from the south at seven miles per hour. Um, and it's a cold start across the entire state of Pennsylvania. You can see that uh, single digits and teens across the entire state of Pennsylvania with your cold spot being Williamsport being in the negative single digits. Uh, looking at your feels like temperatures, however, you can see that we are in the negative double digits for Bradford, right around minus 14 degrees, uh, but it feels like three degrees in Philadelphia. So we've got that nice temperature, uh, feels like temperature contrast throughout the entire state. But no matter how you slice it, it will be a cold start to your morning and a cold day to end your work week. So taking a look at the temperature change uh, compared to yesterday, you can see that there is, it is a colder start to your morning than yesterday across the eastern two-thirds of Pennsylvania. But you can see that over in the west here, notice these oranges and yellows that are just starting to make their way into northwest Pennsylvania. This is very relevant for our weather on Saturday, Sunday. Uh, because that will be leading to warmer temperatures uh, Saturday and Sunday as that makes its way east. Uh, temperatures could get even close to 40 degrees uh, by Sunday uh, afternoon. So taking a look at your future cast, you can see that temperatures do get close to 40 uh, in State College. Uh, you can see that by so Sunday at 7.30 in the morning, you can see that it's a very warm start uh, very, very much above average for State College for Sunday uh, with a chance for rain showers during that time frame. You can see, taking a look at the national radar composite, you can see that there is a little bit of light snow to talk about in upstate New York, but that's not really too much big of a big deal. Our big story is what's coming in on the west. That'll scoot its way east, and that will provide our chance for precipitation on Saturday into Sunday uh, in the form of two waves of precipitation. The first wave will be arriving on Saturday. You can see that there's our first wave right here uh, into upstate New York. That'll largely scoot its way off to the north of State College. You can see it will be generally cloudy across Pennsylvania, uh, with the exception of South Central Pennsylvania, seeing more sun than clouds. Uh, but State College will be uh, overcast for your Saturday and for your Sunday as well. Uh, Sunday will feature that chance for rain showers. As you can see uh, right here, there's your rain showers. Um, and it'll be, it won't be a a washout by any means, but there could definitely be uh, some more moderate pockets of showers uh, for your Sunday. You see those clouds continue to persist for Monday, and for Monday into Monday night, there will be a second wave of precipitation that looks to give uh, mostly frozen precipitation for State College, so stay tuned for that. Uh, so here's the one of our computer models, the European model. And you can see it gives State College an inch of snow with this second wave. Uh, but it's perfectly possible that the heaviest snow, which is right now in uh, north of State College, uh, could bump a little bit south and west over the next couple days. And that could lead to a little bit higher amounts than shown here. So stay tuned to the Campus Weather Service for further updates on that. So take a look at your forecast for today. You can see it's going to be sunny and cold. Temperature right around 24 degrees for your high. Uh, it will feel like it's in the single digits to possibly near zero, though, gusting to near, th near, uh, near 30 at times, 20 to 30 miles per hour. Uh, so tonight is going to be a, a lot warmer than than this morning was. You can see it's going to be a low of 19 degrees. Uh, that wind will continue to be out of the southwest of 5 to 10, bringing that warmer, warmer air. Uh, and that southwest wind will persist for tomorrow, uh, continue to bring that warmer air. High of 36 degrees. Uh, the, the clouds will be in the picture, uh, so don't be uh, expecting too much sun for your Saturday.
Take a look at your seven day forecast. You can see that Friday will be very cold. In fact, the coldest day of the entire next seven days. Uh, those clouds do roll in on Saturday though, uh, with temperatures right around the mid to upper 30s. Uh, Sunday will feature the chance for rain showers, temperatures right around 40 for your high, but that wintry precipitation moves back in on Monday uh, with a chance for snow lingering as late as Tuesday afternoon, with the next chance for snow coming in the form of a clipper on, th on Thursday. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I am your student meteorologist, Paul Michalajczyk. Have a great day.